one mile. Stay to the left in US 101 North, Los Angeles. <laughs> Today was a day. I am, I think the lack of sleep is catching up to me. Yeah, so for this gig, call time was 6.30. Um, of course, I'm gonna get there six, uh, 30 minutes earlier to park and walk there. And then, um, you know, a little fluff time for traffic. And then also, haha, <laughs> today, they have the LA Marathon going on. I don't know why I said it's so weird, LA Marathon. LA Marathon. But they had the LA Marathon going on today and um, it just scared me. So I was like, okay, let me get up even earlier. So I was shooting to get up for 3.50, 3.45, 3.50, and then um, my body just wakes up on its own, even though I did take melatonin and I woke up at three by myself and I was like, fuck. So I decided to just get up and go make sure I have everything and just bounce. I got ready in the car. I'm really proud about that. Um, oh, the lighting just got really bad. I just arrived at LA City College on um, parking structure. Yes, I have my hazards on. It is like four in the morning, so it's fine. So yeah, that's what I'm working with. Um, give me a second, I need to dissect this. So this is how you change, change into your contact because you didn't want to get into traffic. You didn't want to put on your contacts too early in the morning because we all know that that is just the worst feeling ever. Um, I have my handy dandy antibacterial soap. You want antibacterial because I feel like I really have antibacterial soap. That way I can really get the bacteria. Um, especially if you don't really know, really get in your hands. So get that. And then I got my water. You don't want to waste water. What I do is I just like recycle and um, fill it up with sink water. That's what I would have washed my hands with anyways. They say you're supposed to wash your hands for 20 seconds and that'll kill all the bacteria. Now I just got to get ready. I wish I could prop this up somehow, but here's my before. And I'm getting ready in the car with this light, this light. I might use my... Um, flashlight if I am desperately needing more but this will do and as you can see it's still dark out yeah let me show you the beautiful night actually beautiful morning Here's the final look. I'm surprised I got full on ready in my car. <laughs> okay, we're not really, not really surprised, but I am impressed that three years ago, Jax intentionally filmed for a voiceover. Like, okay, and I can tell I'm feeling myself. Like, yes. We're just gonna ignore that my face doesn't match my neck. <clears throat> I blame the flash, but I'm rocking these cute earrings and a bold red lip. And I haven't worn a red lip in so long. And this is a great reminder of how powerful and what a statement it can be. So we're gonna do that soon. So I guess I can just record right here, but this is, um, I didn't have time this morning to film. I was supposed to wake up at like 3, 45, 50 and get ready and then go. But there's the LA Marathon today and I woke up at by myself at 3 a.m. Oh, there's like no one, I'm fucking going. I woke up by myself at 3 a.m. So I thought, you know what? Let me just go, curl my hair, fuck it, right? And just um, honestly bust a mission and get here and put my makeup on in the car. That way I avoided traffic. I flew by. It was amazing. I was really happy with that. All right, I gotta go. So I'm back in my car. Wait, I forgot my pizza outside. Aww. Legit, I am like the master at leaving stuff on top of my car. <laughs> I actually, I can think of two stories off the top of my head about stuff that I've left at the top of my car and it was a little crazy, but um, you know what? We'll save that one for another day. So, I'm back in my car. 
back in my sweet lady. I haven't named her yet. I'm gonna name my car. But anywho, um, time to get out of here. I got released a little bit early. And now I'm headed home. I'm gonna go pick up Luna, and then I'm gonna go and have a girls' day with my mom and my sister. I'm so excited. I can catch them up on everything. Anywho, this backstage work was great. I just signed an NDA, but I will say, I feel confident. Like, seeing the way the actors... Hey, it's me, Editing Jax, and I'm sorry. I just... <laughs> I can't. Um, it's really weird seeing me from three years ago, and I left out a lot of details that I still remember about this project, so I decided to take over. I coincidentally met another actor who is from where I'm from, and then I also met another actor who you see later in the video. Her name is Jen, and we shared the same acting coach at the time, which was super cool. And then I also met this beautiful soul, Stefan, and later on, I see them on my For You page, and I'm like, oh my gosh! So it's super cool to see Stefan doing cool things on TikTok. But going back to feeling confident, I saw the actors and I saw how it worked and it just really popped that bubble and illusion that it's so out of my league. And it's wild that the pandemic had hit the US after this video was taken and it sucked. I was going out on a lot of auditions and getting the ball rolling, but I'm back and I'm here to stay. And since 2020, I've grown so much. I've learned so many new things. I've tried so many new experiences and I've met so many beautiful souls. I can't wait to take you on my journey and I love you so much. Bye.